Welcome back to Backyard Dad Zone. We hey. are the Beard Bros. Welcome to the Backyard Dad Zone. What's up? I'm, I'm Thomas. <laughs> I'm 29 years old. George 38. 38. We are old. hanging out. <laughs> I'm, the, I'm the equivalent of Pickle Rick. <laughs> I'm 38. I'm 38. <laughs> Look at me. Hey guys, it's, it's the Beard Bros. <laughs> What's up? Act two. I'm 38, Morty. <laughs> <laughs> I love these frozen animations. Dude, they're so fucking good. It's like a mechanic that you like feel like you're like, oh yeah, this was in Sonic, but it like kind of ne really it wasn't. never was. I mean, Ice Cap Zone like kind of has it, but like not even really. Like you do, I think you do end up frozen or surfing on frozen blocks at some point. Probably. Yeah. Or you become the block at one point. Yeah. I uh, took a really fucked up route. I never take this route, so I don't know where I'm going. To the right. Hey. Hey, hey, hey! How about to the finish line? Hashtag hedgehog. You know what I'm saying? No. Watch the race when you're as fast as Sonic. All right, guys. Here we go. We're back. Yo. So the, this one we've done before. The um, pea soup GameCube zone. So <laughs> because we started the game over for our third time because we're doing these in sessions. Third. Um. Wait. What? We had to. Every time we stopped playing the game. Every time we turn off the console. Right. Um, so... Oh, you mean like it just starts the rotation It starts over. the yeah, rotation yeah, yeah. to where you... Where you... From the beginning. So yeah. in this case, here we are. We are doing this again. This is one of the ones you like barely didn't get, right? Yeah, I, I made a... Uh, I, I, I like had it, and then I made the wrong turn. I like turned too early because I was going too fast. Jafiel. Jafiel. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. What do you mean? Something about like poorly singing retro game music just brings me like like crazy joy? amounts of joy. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy amounts. Crazy, like it shouldn't be that fun to be do that dumb thing that I do. Well, the fact that it's like then warranted by everyone being like, do the thing, do the thing. Yeah. They love it when we're like, <laughs> oh, here we go. It's fast, boys. <laughs> oh shit, fucked up. You're in it. You did it. You done it. You're doing it. And then you just gotta walk back over there and pick up them. Then we got one more field like that, and then we're done. I found it. Time to be done! Alright, so now, there's probably just four of those, like, by themselves things, right? Whew. You did that in a way where I was, like, scared that you weren't gonna get them all. <laughs> Sick. Oh. God, the ugly colors of the floor are like tripping me out. Oh! I almost killed myself there. <laughs> yeah! Another one down! Another one down! Another one down! Another one down to down! I'm down! <laughs> Hey, did you want to go get Chipotle? I'm down! <laughs> Poor Tails. Tails is like, well, if Sonic did it, I should do it. Fun fact, here's a secret! Tails is like the dog when... Hey... What was that? Didn't did it. Secret. A life? A ring, my dude. Tails, ooh, ooh, Tails oh, is like oh, a dog oh, oh, when you throw oh, a ball. Oh. And you bounce the ball off the wall, and then the ball like goes another direction. You know how like a dog will like follow the ball, even though he can just go straight to the. This is a convoluted example at this point. <laughs> dog owners, do you know when you throw the ball and it bounces off the wall, and your dog just doesn't realize I'm in trouble. that he can I fucked up. just go straight to the ball? You guys get it. That's what tails is like. Speaking of tails, this is like. Feels like Tails themed level. Oh shit, Ring City. Ring City, bitch. Ring City, bitch. 
Get your wings on. Don't fucking step on my fucking bonus level, bitch. What you know about bonus, bitches? I'm gonna take the rings. What? <laughs> I'm picking them up. Like they're my kids from school. <laughs> bitch. <laughs> I ain't leaving oh, him in that shit. after school oh, program, dog. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Here we go. Teach him to be a slacker, yo. Nobody does homework at the after school. Nobody. It's just to hang out with that girl that you like. Let's be real. Beer Bros homework. Question of the day. Whatever the fuck it's called. <laughs> <laughs> Will you... Alex Fasciani, 41-year-old man. Uh, 41-year-old man. When you did, if, if you stayed after school at public school, did you do your homework at that, at that, uh... Woo! Whoa! We fast! We fast! <laughs> Ring City's too fast! Live in Ring City! Guys, I feel like we need to address something. Yeah. Um, they fucking announced a remake of L.A. Noir for PS4, Xbox One, and, and Nintendo that Switch. VR. Yeah, and there's gonna be a new VR thing. Which we're doing! Boom! We're doing it, Boom, bitches! we're doing it! You can't stop the cops! You better believe we're getting that fucking visor! <laughs> Al Alex, for a second, scared me. <laughs> you didn't see his face, but it was scary. I'm just morphing into Alex Jones. <laughs> that was a good Alex Jones impression. <laughs> WE'RE PUTTING ON THE VISOR! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! It was too good! What the fuck, Alex? Why <laughs> 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 oh my, my diet pills! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Alex, oh my god, Alex! BeerGirlsWars.com! <laughs> Yo, next t-shirt promo, Alex. <laughs> We're gonna fucking just put you- dress you up like Alex Jones and have you do that. Oh my Holy god. Holy god, Put it's... me in a suit and... This is great, by the way. mashed potatoes for three weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Get me all red. <laughs> oh man, I'd make my whole family so angry. Yo, if you wanna see something crazy... If you wanna see something crazy... There's is a show on the History Channel... ...called... Decoded. Yeah. Which is starring Brad Meltzer, who's like a comic book writer, and he uh -huh. writes like like the type of book that's like you never even know about, but it's like on the New York Times bestseller list somehow. You know what I'm talking about? Like yeah. just like some book like that like every book I read on the New York Times bestseller. Yeah, like somehow <laughs> just some like fucking book that everybody reads at the pool for like a month and it's like the most best selling book in the country kind of thing. And uh he has this show that's like all about like you know, oh, like, we're gonna go find out about, like, what the real deal is with Fort Knox. Like, how <laughs> strong is it? Like, or, like, sure, you know, uh, is there really, like, a secret compartment? Like, national treasure type shit. Sure. And, uh, one of the things that they investigated was a thing called the Bohemian Grove, which is a thing in, like, NorCal area where all these, like, rich people, like, societies, like, movers and shakers, basically. Did that... Did you do that right? No. Um, you know, like the rich, like, influencers of the world. Did you do that right? No. Did you get all the rings? I'm missing two. Weird. Um, really weird. Really bad, actually. But basically, it's like a secret glade. There's like, n they get naked sometimes. There's like, you know, like weird, like, kind of like... Got it. Oh my god, that was tight. Uh, like weird stuff goes on. They like wear costumes. There's like naked people you around. Say, sorry, you say powerful influencers? Powerful influencer. I'm not talking about like Markiplier and Jack Sept I'm talking about That's like me, dude. I identify with that. I'm talking about like I'm a millenni millennial influencer, dude. No, I'm talking about like like Don't tread on me, John dude. D. Rockefeller. Oh, like I I'm see. talking like the real deal. Oh, okay. And But just so we know, I want everyone to know I'm an influencer. Yeah. <laughs> just You are. You are, dude. Chris, Chris, put a picture of a headshot of me. Put a picture of Ger put a picture of Gerard. Put a, put a sexy ass headshot of me that I took when I was young, and and put, and then just put influencer in put, in a very bold font. Put a uh, hashtag sup brands. Sup brands. Yeah. Pepsi, you want some of this, this this cola D? Let's go. Uh, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Sorry, let's get back on track. Yeah. So but just in to be this, clear, we I am an influencer. In this in this society. <laughs> in this society. 
<laughs> it's in a it's in like a glade in NorCal. <laughs> and okay. and a giant stone owl statue speaks with the voice of Walter Cronkite and like they do like this like wait it's not really Walter Cronkite yeah it yeah, is the, 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 they, it's fucking they got him yeah yeah and I'm not, I'm, I'm not joking like these are this is like the real deal get the fuck out of yeah. here you're full of shit no I'm not and uh so they're like yo the security at this place is like so crazy like almost nobody's been there who's not a member but there is one guy who has like video of doing it and he's done it at least two times and he's like an expert and let's go meet him and it's like you know reality show meet the expert except it's fucking alex jones from like a little bit before he like became alex jones okay and so in this fucking episode of the show they're like sneaking into this fucking place with alex jones like in kayaks alex just take a second to enjoy this music yo so this is heavy shinobi i think is his name uh, yeah, his, name, fucking is, sexy his name is Heavy, Heavy Shinobi. He's one of the egg robos that got, like, changed by the Phantom Ruby or whatever. Your bro's homework, get laid to this music, let's go. But let me tell you what. His sound effects, <laughs> all are from Sh Revenge of Shinobi for Sega Genesis. What? No way! Yeah, all that all that robot sound effects were... I, I got distracted talking about Alex Jones. And I got but, distracted talking about having sex with that music. Yeah, dude, I would have sex with that music. But look, go... Go back and look, and you'll see that all the sound effects are from... Revenge of Shinobi, which is pretty cool. Yo, that's and, great. And if you have a flame shield in that fight, you are immune to ice, so it's a lot easier. Whoa! Oh. Here we go. Welcome to the Secret Garden Zone. It's not Secret Garden. Start the yeah. speedway. Hell yeah! Talking about the fuck music. Ooh. <laughs> Yeah. I know we got kids in this show, but listen, sometimes, ladies, you just gotta... Kids, part of having sex is that you gotta play music from video games. <laughs> and don't listen to what anybody else tells you. Don't That's, listen to anyone. Don't listen don't to us. Listen, don't, no, listen to us. No, don't play, listen to us. We're crazy. Play game music during bedroom activities. Put that online. And you know what? And if, and, and if bedroom activities are not accessible to you, that's okay. Not right now, but help a friend. Or you know if, what? Just if, if a friend's like, "Hey, I'm gonna go have sex with my lady or my man or whoever," and you got then, Nobu then, Umatsu's then, Final Fantasy IX vinyl soundtrack, you know, it, you know what? Slide that into his bag on his way out the door. <laughs> or, or what you do is you fucking Chris put a picture of that shitty ass smiley emoji that everyone loves. You make that face, the like you fucking, sexy smiley, just like the sideways smile. Yeah, I know exactly. And which then one you you're fucking make that face and you put that music on for him. Cause you know what? You may not be getting laid, but you're helping your friends. Everyone likes getting laid. Even even bunnies. <laughs> even even bunnies, Rick. Even bunnies like getting laid. <laughs> what do you mean, Morty? I'm 38! 38! I'm 38, Morty! Middle aged Rick! Guys, aren't we great? Aren't we funny? Don't we make the memes that you care about? Yeah, we watch the show. You God, better believe hip. it. The we're show you hip. like, we know about that we know show. It. I got fidget spinners for days. We watch it. I got a free fidget spinner. I dabbed on the haters when they told me to dab. Yeah. What's Guys, up? Real, real talk. Fuck. Don't do what YouTubers tell you to do. Do whatever the fuck you want. <laughs> do what I say. No, I, don't. My shit is gold. Deba what? <laughs> Debatable. I'm an influencer. Chris, every time we say the word influencer, I want that fucking sup influencer image. Guys, buy Guys, brands. This. Brands. Brands. Let's do a, let's do a case study. Let's do a case study. Gerard, what's your favorite thing to buy? Nintendo. Nintendo. What a great company, man. You wait, guys wait, should all... wait, this doesn't work. I already work with Nintendo. You guys should buy Nintendo games. <laughs> <laughs> we, we're fucking crazy. You guys should buy it's Nintendo over. It's over. games. This is this episode, this entire episode, Alex. Yeah. This entire episode sounds like a Beer Bros anime that doesn't exist. Yeah. That's a, That should be the name of a series, and we just don't upload any episodes. <laughs> <laughs> we should make a playlist of that. Beer Bros our... animated, it's just an empty playlist. Yeah. <laughs> it's like the Tony Hawk 2 soundtrack. Oh, son of a beesh. Um, so, I don't know if you know this, this zone is actually a zone from, uh... Sonic CD? Yeah. 
I did not when I played this, but uh, Bradley informed me. Bradley yeah. came in the room and was like, "Oh, this is from Sonic CD." Yeah, which is really cool. Like it's my Bradley impression, everyone. Oh, I love Sonic CD. Oh, I, I'm really honored to be in the room. Are you playing Sonic CD, Gerard? Yeah, Gerard's weird Bradley impression is like, for some reason, he's like really obsessed with Sonic CD. <laughs> Every time he's like, "You guys want anything? Coffee? Sonic CD? Sonic CD? I got copies of it." <laughs> yeah. Um, I heard you like Sonic CD, Gerard, so I got you a couple <coughs> copies of it. So, guys, send in your copies of Sonic CD. I actually never played it, nor do I own it. So, yeah, please. Uh, 8 or 90, if you guys would please uh, send if in... If you want the Beer Bros to play Sonic CD, yeah. send me a copy. Uh, actually, you know, if you guys just send it in with, like, with a copy of Werewolf, that'd be great. <laughs> uh, the joke to that is I have several copies of Werewolf. Please do not send me your copy of Werewolf. Guys, listen. This is a mission that only you guys can solve. This is your fault, Alex. S and Gerard. I was thinking about Werewolf. Dude, what a great video game. And don't you wish you had more of it? Send Gerard your copies. Hashtag influencer, what's up? <laughs> Werewolf <laughs> devs, come at me. Find me. Data East. Where you at, Data Why East? Why are you bankrupt? What happened? Does John own Data East, too? Uh, I think so. He bought- I think Game 31 also owns Data he East. He bought LJN and Data East, right? Am I no, wrong? Acti uh, Acclaim. And Iguana claim. Games, I think, too. No, Iguana not, not Iguana Games. Iguana Games is retro studios now. What? Okay. All right. You what? know, you know what I'm yeah. talking about. That, that's that chill ass. Uh, yeah, I remember. Isn't that isn't that Naughty Dog? What? No. Iguana? No. Maybe I'm wrong. We're uh, all wrong, Alex. So check this out. This is the first time that you can use Knuckles in this zone because Knuckles is in Sonic CD. My name's Knuckles. I like a chuckle. My name's Knuckles. I like to chuckle. I do improv raps. Improv with, raps. With my Pokemon sh chuckle. What's you up? You want some of my emeralds? Um. So what about him? He He's just playable in this for yeah. the first time. Oh, like, that's the trivia. That he's yeah. just playable for the first time. Yeah. That's all. Yeah. Alex, I'm starting to doubt your committed commitment to the trivia. What do you mean? That's not trivia. That's what just, do you mean? That's Knuckles is never was never playable in Sonic CD, so playing him in this level in this game is a first appearance for Knuckles in a level from Sonic CD. That's trivia. That's, that's just true. Also, in that's Sonic CD, also in- that That's exactly what trivia is! It's facts! I don't believe it's you. It's a list of facts! About, interesting facts about the game! I miss the Beard Bros, you guys. <laughs> I miss them. I miss them. Where are they? They changed Upload so a video. much. Fuck. Guys, blink twice if you found the Beard Bros. Dude, if you're being Gerard, if you're being held as a captive <laughs> against your own wishes, uh, grab your arm in a weird way and whisper. This is the best episode be really ever filmed. <laughs> whisper off camera that you need help. Help. <laughs> I can't see because my eyes are swelling with tears. <laughs> That's why you don't get sentimental in the car, you guys. Oh my goodness. Don't get sentimental and drive. Um, alright, so, Sonic CD, <laughs> uh, each level is a zone. <laughs> Sorry, just, uh, each level is a zone? Yeah, uh, <laughs> they don't use that, those words in Sonic CD, so they had to, so they, they like, kind of, like, They had to clarify it? They just adapted it. Okay. Like, it wasn't called a zone. Uh, you know. Like zone each each so in in most of the Sonics both levels are the zones but in Sega CD or in Sonic CD each level is called a zone and they're called rounds that are acts it's come it's just it's different in this game than it is whatever it doesn't matter okay yeah oh my goodness um also there's like a famous like laugh during the Act One music um and T Lopes like put a video on Twitter. That's like a response to that. Uh, people are like, what happened to the hue hue hues? Uh huh. I'm gonna try and find the uh, tweet. It's only from like a couple days ago. It's from like August 31st. T Lopez, I love you! You did such a good job with this fucking music, dude. I know you don't know who I am, that's okay. I don't know who I am either. I know, uh, I know what I'm supposed to be though. An influencer. Put influencer. that fucking picture up there, Chris. What's up, Brands? What's up, Brands? What's brands. up, my Brands? What's up, my Brands? I'll drink your barbecue sauce, let's go! What's up, my Brands? You guys remember Claim Jumper? Apparently they don't. What's up? Oh, I'll rep the shit out of you, Claim Jumper! 
Fuck you, claim jumper. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. This level's really cool, Alex. This is a very hard one. This is the the maze. I mean, they're all mazes. This one's like a little bit more mazy. Maisie Williams. Arya Stark. Can we talk about how fucking annoying it is the way that people pronounce Arya's name in the show? Like, they don't know how to say it? They're like, Arya. I know, like, you know, they're British or whatever, for the most part, but like, it's not like a Br I don't feel like people who are British say it like that. I don't know. If you're English and you watch Super Beard Bros, or you're from anywhere that speaks English natively and you have a quote-unquote what an American person would call an accent, please record yourself saying the name Arya Stark and send it to us. Just say Arya, because it's like, in Game of Thrones, a lot of the characters are like, Arya. It sounds weird. That's a hard one. Yeah. That'll be one that you'll be seeing a lot of, probably. Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh. Uh, Lucas Carvalho. Yeah. Uh, said that this is one of his. He's uh, the, one of the game's artists. He said this was his favorite zone that he worked on. Um, it also shares many similarities with Marble Garden Zone from Sonic Three. I don't know if you noticed that. I feel like they kind of do that where they kind of picked one that was like. Kind it's, of similar it's got to the same the same uh, like mechanics. The, yeah, yeah. The, the pull string. Yeah, I feel like a lot of the levels in this game they'd be Alex, like. Alex, this is something that that is really cool. I don't know if you've seen this, but yeah. I don't I'm know not, what that was. I haven't finished the game. Future. That's so, all from Sonic CD. So in Sonic CD, the first act is the past. The second act is the future. Yeah, that game is crazy. That game is weird because I didn't find it till much later because I didn't have a Sega CD or whatever they're called. Sega CD? Right? Uh, I think so. Yeah. Uh, by the way, this has one of the harder achievements in the game. Uh, surprised they didn't call it <laughs> Gotta Go Fast, but uh, the achievement is about beating this stage in one minute. Wow. Guys. Um. Oh, God. What was I just going to say? It was so... It was so- Oh! I forgot. If you guys want to see something fucking hilarious, I just gotta shout this out because this- This account- I know it's- it's growing, but I just want to rep it because it's so fucking funny. Check out Sega CD Games on Twitter. Guys, throw up a couple, uh, of their tweets. Just throw up the pictures of some of their tweets. Is this gonna be you, Chris, who's editing this? Yeah, throw up some of their, uh, tweets. This shit is comedy, you guys. It's a- If you're- if you are a retro gaming fan, with a sense of humor, I feel like you will really appreciate Woo! Sega CD Games, the Twitter. Very funny stuff. Hey Chris, are you the one that uploads these videos? Are you uploading them in, in 30 FPS? Because I've, I've seen some audience members complain that you're uploading in 30 FPS. Hmm. Man, remember when Sega Genesis used to be in 60 FPS? This sucks right here. This stage is very scary. Oh my god. Oh, I hate that. It like almost behooves me to go do those first because they're like they get dumb with, and you should the, do when it's with slow. the speed it's real tough. Oh shit. I mean, we're making our way downtown with these. Yeah, dude. Walking fast. Do you think Sonic, like, speed walks in his day-to-day? -day? Probably not. Like, I, I don't know. Like, he goes fast all the other times, like, maybe... How many of those are there? Not exactly sure. Trying not to think about it, you know? That was a lot of rings. <laughs> oh my... Oh my! Fuck! I did, I forgot. What a crazy level that is! I did that one on my, on my first try too when I first did it. So uh, I don't know how accurate this is, but you know when you 
that that diamond there that you just got from the rocket? Yeah. Apparently, that's a reference to the song Diamond in the Sky from Sonic R, but like... I don't know. I don't know about that. I feel like that's a bit of a stretch. Yikes! I love that little mechanic. Oh shit! Game over! Game over! Did you like perfectly land on the track? Probably. That's crazy. La 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 So the, the achievement is just for beating the, f the so second stage in a minute? Yes. Whoa! That was cool. It's so crazy that they just let you beat the game like this. Guys! Check out this fucking hologram of Metal Sonic kicking a rabbit in the ass. What's that about? You know what I'm saying? There's Metal Sonic, we gotta go! Come on, Metal Sonic! Um, now this stage, I don't know if- like, we might have to die. Because I- th I don't know if we can actually be Metal Sonic in this Sonic form. So Metal Sonic actually, uh, comes from Sonic CD. I don't know if you knew that. Um, that's- that's his first appearance. And so a lot of his sound effects in this are from that. And this machine right here is actually pretty much straight out of Knuckles' Chaotix. I don't know if you've ever seen that. It's during the World Entrance Level 1 in uh, Knuckles Chaotix. Um, and that's pretty crazy. Also, uh, the guide points to the two Metal Sonics in the tubes. Oh, that does still work. You know the, the Metal Sonic in the tubes? That you can see on the sides there? Yeah. That's like kind of a new thing, and uh, nobody really knows like what that's about. What the fuck was that? Yeah, I don't know what that's about. I don't know what that's Yo! about. Yo! Yeah, he did some like next level shit right there. I've oh, never shit. seen that before. I've never seen that before. Yeah, that have was you, weird. Chris? Yeah. He does that. He'll shoot one. Like if you hit one too hard, he'll come back and bounce around. You're telling me What's that I that hit two so kicking a hard the they ass. showed up fucking 30 seconds later? Yeah, that's yeah. like when you smack someone so hard their mama can feel it. <laughs> Shout out to all the moms that get get that must be rough, smacked. man. Yeah, like when your kid gets smacked and you're like, ah, oh, shit. I'm just trying to make my fucking soup. I imagine somewhere that happens, you hear the Star Wars. <laughs> <laughs> my son. <laughs> oh. Oh! I don't give a fuck! I'm the best! What are you gonna do, huh? Yeah, Metal Sonic, you fucking metal bitch! Metal bitch? Fucking nice shoes, you fucking robot! You don't need shoes, bitch! What are you gonna do, make your feet ache? Okay. You just gotta hit him when he's in the middle. If you hit him at just the right speed, it should just point him right at it. Oh, Tails! There it is. There it is! There it is! Yo! Oh! What a cheeky little snowboarder Sonic. Is it weird that I think of him as a snowboarder? Yeah! Form 1 down! Oh yeah. I actually think Form 1 is harder... Than Form 2? Yeah. I agree. Though, it is distressing, the wall. The wall is a bit distressing, yes. But the wall also helps you. The wall. The wall. The wall. Yeah, yeah. Woo! 
Do 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 do. Look at this tight ass background. Do you imagine that like the horns that are this making up the stage are what's playing the music? If they were doing that, that'd be so sick. There's the wall. The wall. And that like low res CD quality Robotnik in the background. I love that. Uh. Alright. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my. Oh my god. Can you fall in those pits? Damn. Get bodied, Metal Sonic, bro! Whoa! <gasps> Whoa! Holy shit! That was some clench fucking play. Oh! Whoa! Oh yes! Alright, next time on Beard Bros, the fucking jam yeah, of the 90s. Yeah, baby! I was- I this, may have flipped out when I saw this. Dude, I was there. I remember when we were- it was just like, Yo, this is in here! But let me tell you what, if you want to get that sex, this is the song. Get that sex. Get that sex. Hey, come on, come on, get that sex. All right, next time on Beard Bros. Next time. What, yo, where's the air at? Oh shit. Where's the air at? There it is. Bye. See you later, Tails. Peace.